All right, Twin Force Fusion. And um, last week I talked to Blue Dot Lightning 2018. For those of you who may know him as KD Man, I, uh, that's his YouTube channel here on the left if you want to give him a shout out. Um, uh, he contacted me via Gmail. And uh, he wanted to talk to me on the phone. He had some questions regarding the HP tuner and the turbos. Uh, we actually had like a four-hour uh, chat, which was good. I learned some stuff and obviously learned some stuff. And uh, I figured I may, uh, wanted to make this video to show him how the, uh, the VCM scanner works on an HP tuner. Now, for a lot of uh, views like him and myself in the past, I had the SCT... Uh, live wire right there uh, i had the uh, this one here the ts plus and uh, but some some of you have like a bdx or something like that uh but now for the last year i've been i've been using the rtd now the one you see on the screen is the rtd plus which is in red the one i have is blue i guess and it's an improvement of what they did but uh, what i'm going to show you on my um, tablet here it's going to be, um, uh, how you call it, uh, the RTD, uh, the blue one. So basically you have to uh, follow the steps and load, uh, load the uh, HP on your tablet or laptop, whatever. And that's where a lot of people feel uncomfortable. Myself, same thing. Had uh, some issues at first. So once you uh, fill the stuff, you, you're obviously going to have an HP tune log file. I'm just going to go in on the VCM scanner and logs, and it's going to show, uh, I think this one I have, I'll, I'll show you a few ones. And let's start maybe with the last one I did. Um, was this the, the short one? I have a short one and a long one. Let me just, just go back one. I'm just going to show you this one here. Maybe a longer one would be easier to explain. So, just like the uh, SCT, whatever um, program you, you may use in the past, you plug on your OBD, OBD2 and you do your pull, save it, and um, tag it and send it to your tuner. HP, HP Tuner is the same thing, but you're able to see some stuff. Now, what I don't have is a window on the bottom that you uh, could go in and modify your fuel tabs or whatever. Like, what, basically what we have with the RTD is a read-only version. So, let, let's just focus here. Let's say uh, uh, on the miles an hour. You see the speed. Um, and... What I'm going to show you, it's always the same pull. So I'm just going to press play here. And you'll see the things go crazy and all that. And uh, I'll come back, restart, and I'll put, let's say, uh, the torque or the turbo flows. And I'll go down and show you, let's say, the boost or whatever. So you'll see exactly my latest uh, revision I have on E30. So let's play. This obviously was done at Boulevard, Mexico. All right. So the main point I push a lot is I want to make sure I'm on full watt in fourth gear to make sure I don't have uh, misfires anymore, which I don't. I did experience at the beginning, but since uh, the last five or six, maybe seven revision, I'm out of... Um... So let's, let's see, go see the torque. So basically, I want to show you a lot of stuff you're able to see from your car and I'm just gonna go back here and press play so you'll see about the torque uh, to, uh, engine torque so 
So if you want to see a, a bit the horsepower, like turbo flow, whatever, you have to multiply by 10. It'll give you an idea. See, this is, uh, it's not a secret. I don't mind showing my data, whatever. It's, uh, all right. So I, I'm not going to show the knock because I didn't have any knock at all. in the, because it, it will, if you ever have knock, whatever, they'll show you on this occasion. I had none. Okay. Let's go see the boost pressure. Now I'm making less boost than when I was running the MKZ uh ter stock turbos but since i'm stage three I've, I've been running less but on this one we did push it a little bit because i'm on e30 so you'll see on the entire pull you'll see the boost uh by the way this is, was a rolling pull i don't do uh from the dig because i'm still on my all season tires and it's still cold and the roads are wet so So pretty flat there at 22, 21.8. And by the way, I'm very happy at this boost level. I don't want, maybe I'll do a spicy uh, a tune for the track, but uh, if ever I'm able to go upper on the ethanol content. So we'll see. I, I'm still uh, like a month and a half before the track. And once the weather be warmer, um, if you want to see knock retard, same thing. You highlight, and during your pull, if there's some knock retard, they'll show it. I don't want a, a spoil alert, but there's none. So you're able, there's all kinds of info. Wastegate duty cycle, wastegate canister pressure. Uh, the turbo speed, I see spinning at over 250,000. Um, you have so much data in here and uh, I'm just gonna keep going here on my right here you got spark advance spark retard uh, long fuel trim short fuel trim and O2 I'm not sure exactly what's that but you have all kinds of info here but your um, tuner will have other tabs later here or on the bottom obviously to do the um, Another thing that's cool you're able to see is uh, the intake temps, uh, you know, before, during, the whatever. You'll see the in, uh, intake temps all the time. Uh, spark source, that's not really something I look. Uh, the absolute map pressure. Um, so there's all kind of stuff that I, honestly, half of it, I don't know exactly what it does. But uh, I stick to the uh, turbo boost. I see if there's some knock. Uh, I, I I like to see the um, the torque the uh, the torque. I just you know if something I see is wrong. Well, obviously your tuner will also see if something's wrong. So for those who don't know, I have a Gmail. If you want to contact me, it's Twin Force. Uh, dot fusion twin force dot fusion at gmail.com um, one thing I, I wanted to do in the future if ever we, we uh, if you contact me and obviously talk tell me what the subject you want to talk uh, I may record a conversation because I found out that I learned some stuff and and, um, and I think it would be cool to share with all of you. Uh, obviously, it's not going to be a live um, conversation because if ever we, we talk personal stuff, I'm going to, you know, edit the video and cut all that. So I'm just going to stick to a, a car talk, let's say. Um, so, yeah, uh, for those who are wondering what I, I'm sure there's a lot of videos out there that may explain this better than me. But what you see, it's on the Ford Fusion Sport. And most of us all have the same mods, you know, we have, may have different turbos, different intercoolers, uh, stock or non-stock uh, injectors or what so on. But uh, basically we seem to have all the same mods, so um, 
it'd be cool to share uh, all that information with you guys and um, yeah if you have questions go ahead again I'm not an expert with HP tuner but I've been using this uh, well for the last year and I did maybe I would leave at least 50 revisions with that and um, so take care and um, Kevin it was nice to have a chat with you take care bye